Hey guys, welcome back. In today's quick tip video, I am going to show you how to customize your workspace uh, by adding windows and taking away windows, uh, these viewports. So let's get started. When you open up Blender, you'll, you'll get the standard window viewport, but you can break this up. All you have to do is go into any one of the corners and you will see that your cursor turns into this plus sign. Anytime you see that plus sign, you click and drag, uh, you will create another viewport. So I'm gonna click and drag, and I'm gonna create another viewport. It works with any viewport, any corner. You can just create another, another uh, viewport. So if I, click and drag towards the center inside this viewport, I will create another window. Um, if I click and drag towards the top, instead of the center, the top half, I will create a vertical window like this. But if I click and drag towards the bottom half, not the center, the bottom, I will create a horizontal window. And so how do we get rid of these windows? You have to be in this viewport and you have to click out, click and drag outside, not towards the center. For example, click and drag outside and you'll see this arrow. That means the left panel will take over the right panel. If I I still have my mouse clicked on. If I drag over to this one, that means the right panel will take over the left panel. Again, I can drag over this way. That means the left panel will take over the right panel. And you can do this with uh, any of these windows. You just have to click, instead of me clicking towards the center, I'll click towards the outside. Now they have to be, uh, they have to be aligned, otherwise it will not work. For example, I am going to add, click and drag towards the center, a third window, and then I'm gonna click and drag another one. So I cannot uh, take this one and drag it over to here because there's two windows. It won't work. It won't work. So I'm gonna have to do these two first. For example, I can click and drag outside, have the right panel take over the left panel, boom. And then this one, I cannot take over these two panels. I'll try it, boom, it doesn't allow me. So what I can need to do is, I need to drag one of these and delete one of these first by clicking dragging outside, that means the bottom panel will take over the top panel, or you could do each one, uh, either one. And then, since there are two panels, now I can drag this one outside, have the left panel take over the right panel. Um, the other thing I wanted to touch um, on is that each and all of these windows Uh, you can change what is in the viewport. Right now it's a 3D viewport, but right here I can put any of these things uh, that are listed here. For example, the outliner. And on this one, I can put the timeline. And on this one, I can put the graph editor. And I can change them at any time, guys. Uh, here, 3D viewport. Here, uh, UV editor here, drivers, wh whatever. Um, I could do another 3D viewport and then get rid of them. Just drag them out, boom, and drag them out, boom. For a quad view, uh, all you have to do is break these into two and then break these into two. <clears throat> break this into two and you have a quad view. Not a big deal. Uh, with Blender, a lot easier 
a lot more flexible, a lot more powerful. Boom, done. Uh, hey guys, as always, if you like the video, hit the like button and subscribe and I will see you on the next one. Thank you.